let us see the construction of a DFU flow using two NOR gates. Basically, we have seen a multi vibrator is nothing but a flip flop which is used to store one bit of information and hence it is referred to as a memory element. There, in SR flip flop, either by constructing using NOR gates or NAND gates, it has two inputs namely set and a reset and two outputs q and q bar both are complementary to each other and they cannot exist in the same state if one is low other one has to be high if this is q this is q bar if this is low this is high and if this is high this has to be low so that is the principle of operation of a flip flop now this deep flip flop employs only one input where these S and R are connected by means of an inverter. The advantage is the input is given to the upper gate of NAR or NAND. The other end is connected through an inverter. Thereby, if high is given here, automatically low is given here. It saves the connection of two inputs. Let us see what you get. So if you give 1, this is what you are getting. If you give 0, <coughs> okay. 0, <coughs> this is 0, so this is 1. And if this is 1, this is 1, so this is going 0. This is 1, automatically this is 0. When one of the inputs to the NOR gate is uh, 0, then this is 